Sure. I'm Nakia from Where's the Buzz. Hey, Cornelius, how are you? Hey, what's up? I'm good. How you doing? I'm doing good. What I still have a lot of emotions after watching the show. Um, what a great show, a great project. And I can only imagine for you for taking on the role because these are real life events, real life people, uh, real life tragedies that happen. So why was it so important for you to take this project on? Well, um, you know, it honestly, I didn't know about the project beforehand. And so um, when I got the audition, it was the first time that I heard about the project. Uh, and so in enlightening myself and becoming more um, educating myself about what actually happened after I booked the role, um, you know, I just immediately felt grateful to be a part of the storytelling of this, of this production, because I then realized really kind of how big of a deal it was, you know, that not many people, because I didn't hear about it, not many people even knew about this and just the opportunity to really um, plant that seed of knowledge for people about what happened. I mean, it's, it's a joy and an honor. Yeah. I, I remember the events when it happened, but watching this, it brought me back to a time because not only do we get the amazing show, we do get real life clips and real life scenes. So I know I was taken aback, like, wow, this, this is what really happened. So for you, because you guys are playing real life people, what was the journey and process like for you tapping into Dr. King, your character? Sure. Yeah. I mean, it was, it was, it was great. I, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't talk to Dr. King at all. I just, I just read the book and found some stuff on the web to kind of get the factual things that happened. And then, you know, my job as an actor is to, to, to collaborate and with other creatives and also bring myself to the role in, in conjunction with the character. It's a, it's a happy marriage. Ha ha. So, uh, you know, in doing that, I just really try to bring myself to it and find the honesty and the authenticity and the integrity of every moment and just hope that that carries forward uh, and, and, and hope that, you know, that the performance brings a sense of truth to, to what was actually going on at the time. Yeah, let me tell you, you guys had me doing my Googles. I was <laughs> watching interviews, reading articles, like, wow, this is, this is very fascinating because it happened not that long ago. And your character, Dr. King says something. He says it only took five things, five days for everything to fall apart. And that's when it clicked for me. Like, this is, this is, this is crazy. So for you, um, for the audience who may not know the depth of Katrina and know the extent of what happened, what do you hope the audience can take away from learning the real life tragedies and the real life stories of these people? Yeah, I think whenever we have, have an opportunity to, to learn, um, about an event and about what really happened. I think the hope is to take away the knowledge so that hopefully history doesn't repeat itself, that hopefully it gives you the nugget of courage to make a different choice, to stand bold in, in what you believe and what you know to be right. And hopefully whatever that is, it comes from a place of, it comes from a place and a foundation of love of just wanting to see not only yourself, but your community and everybody thrive. Uh, and, you know, sometimes that just requires you to, to plant a flag down hard in the soil, twist that thing, get it rooted and, and stand proudly for what you believe in, and fight for it and know that it's, it's possible, but it takes a village. Um, but that village starts with you. Yeah, that's beautifully said, because I needed that. I told you, I think I had a lot of emotions after watching the show. <laughs> a yeah. lot of emotions, good and bad, and it brought back a lot of memories. So you guys did a phenomenal job. You did such a phenomenal job, and I just wanted to say congratulations. Uh, thank you for the love. I appreciate that. Where is the buzz? Oh, yeah. Where is the buzz? You said we was mine, oh, 